Hi everyone and welcome to our Azure Developer Channel. My name is Julia and I am a Program Manager in the Azure API Center team at Microsoft. In this video today, I will be talking about our product, Azure API Center, your one-stop solution for inventorying and managing your organization's APIs. Today, I will demonstrate how you can easily enable the new API Center portal with just a few simple steps. So let's get started. Before you can use your API Center portal, we first have to configure an identity provider so users can sign in to our portal using Microsoft Entra. For this, we have to create a new app registration in our tenant. As soon as the app has been registered, we will add a new platform configuration via the authentication tab. Make sure to define your reply URL consisting of your API Center service name and region. Next, we will add a new API permission to our app. So search for Azure API Center and add the user impersonation scope. Now we are ready to configure our API Center portal. We only have to provide the client ID of our previously registered app. And now we are able to view our API Center portal. Okay, it looks like that I don't have the right permissions yet. So let me add a new role assignment to my user. The role I'm looking for is called Azure API Center Data Reader and can be assigned to users, groups, or service principals. We highly recommend to check out dynamic membership rules for groups in Microsoft Enter to have a lot of flexibility with your assignments. Now that I have this role assignment added, let's check out the API Center portal again. As you can see, now I'm able to successfully log in and see all of the APIs within my API Center. Thanks for watching this video on Azure API Center, the new center of your API universe. If you have any feedback or questions, feel free to leave a comment or reach out to me directly.